Learn how to use the ClipChamp timeline and explore all of the new features we've just added. Start by logging into ClipChamp or sign up for free. Next, you'll be taken inside the editor. For this tutorial, I've already imported in my content as you can see here. So the first update I'll showcase is our new and improved seeker and timestamps. You'll notice the seeker is now a lot larger and it's easier to navigate. Now, when you're dragging the seeker across your timeline, it will show the video timecode above. This will also happen whenever and wherever you hover over your timeline. This feature helps adjust the duration of your clips more accurately. For example, when trimming a clip by dragging it to the left, the video timestamp will show above. By dragging it to the right, the new item duration will show. This also helps with accuracy of trimming. For another example, if I want this clip in the middle trimmed to an exact timestamp, I can simply hover to find that perfect timestamp like this, then click on the timeline, drag my clip to that point, and I now know it's at the perfect time and spot. The next new update is the forward and back buttons. You can now either select the option to jump five seconds forward or five seconds backwards with these buttons here. Alternatively, you can use your mouse to either click to the point you want on your timeline or just drag your seeker there. And lastly, you can use your left or right arrows on your keyboard to move the seeker across your timeline to the timestamp you're looking for. Lastly, there's been a few more updates, including moving the undo and redo buttons to the top left of the editor. You can either click on either one of these or on your keyboard, hit Command Z to undo a change or Command Shift C to redo a change. And finally, for an immersive experience of your video, you now have the option to preview it in full screen mode. Just navigate over to the full screen preview button, select that, and your video will then open in full screen where you can preview and play it. To minimize that full screen, just click the button here or hit escape on your keyboard. And those are the new updates to the ClipChamp timeline. If you like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for our weekly how-to videos.